Falcons up their record at eight and one in volleyball as they pick up a fourth consecutive match victory, opening up conference play with a three sets to one match victory against Lakeland. Haley Cito, our guest, one of the setters on this team, coming through with 22 assists in this four set match victory. And your thoughts as, as a setter, being part of a two setter formation, are there challenges to that? Is it something that you've kind of become accustomed to? Um, well, for me, and I know for our other setter too, it's something we've done for our whole life, so we're really used to it. It's kind of nice because we get to see all the hitters, and it's not just like I'm just setting one specific person all the time. You know, you get to hit, you get to set different right sides, you get to set different outsides, and so that's it's just we're used to it at this point in our lives. So it's yeah, it's just second nature. And speaking of different hitters. How nice of a luxury is it they have so many different options. We saw that again in this matchup with so many players stepping up. Yeah, it's really awesome. We really don't have anywhere where we're lacking. Our outsides are great, our middles are great, our right sides are great. So as a setter, I have every option in the world. It's really nice. Look at a matchup like this. You guys come out and find ways to take care of business sets one and two. Lakeland controls set number three. What was said by coach in between sets three and four to make sure that Lakeland wasn't able to steal momentum and force the winner to take soul? I mean, it was really just our own mistakes. It was nothing they were doing. It was all us, so we just had to figure out for ourselves. And really, Coach leaves it up to us most of the time. She'll gives us, she gives us hints and that type of thing, but we figured it out for ourselves, and she just kicked our butts a little bit, and we got in gear and figured it out. Do you feel like there's some pressure there knowing that you guys have a bullseye, defending conference champs, pretty to finish first, and know that you guys can't take a set off because that other team across the way is hungry to try to pull off the upset? I mean, sometimes it's a little nerve-wracking, but at this point, like, we welcome it. We really want them to take it to us. We want to play our best ball. We want them to play their best ball. We don't want to have a game where it's just easy for us. We like the competition. So then in set number four, in which the Falcons were able to take care of the match, in your opinion, was the big difference just, again, correcting some of those mistakes mm -hmm. and not committing number of errors? Yeah, just clean up our side of the net. It's our mistakes. We're in our own heads. It's really nothing that the other teams are doing. They get good hits once in a while, but, I mean, it's all in our heads, and we have the ability to win every game. So Let me ask, for you personally, coming back this season, did not play in a match last year, were involved in the, the lineup back in 2015. What's that journey kind of been like to get back out there and be in this rotation? Oh, it's been awesome. I... Needed my year off last year. I was just for school, and I mean, I just it was for me. But I'm so so excited to be back on the, the team and just playing. I mean, I missed it a lot. I didn't realize how much I missed it until I was back, and I'm so happy to be back. Just finally, any your thoughts on the weekend? I had you guys go down to Carth. There's another tournament, another tournament mm -hmm. environment, some good non-conference competition with three matches coming up Friday and Saturday. I'm so excited. I love playing good competition. It's nice to see teams that aren't in our conference, so we get to see like what other conferences are like and. Just like our Carthage team, like they're a great team, and we get to see how we match up against a team that's probably ranked a little bit higher than us. So it just kind of gives us a feel of where we are throughout the nation. So that's pretty cool. Thanks for your time. Get yeah, it done. Thank you. Falcons knock off the Muskies three sets to one.